So the youth contract, um, from what you've heard and what you know about it, good idea? I think it was the very least the government needed to be doing. Um, I mean, you know, my position is that um, I'm a very proud Liberal Democrat and I'm pleased that my party is in government. However, it's not a surprise to anyone who knows me or follows me on Twitter or whatever to know that I disagree with quite a fair amount of what my party has done in mm -hmm. government. Um, I think there's extenuating circumstances around that, um, but my own personal view is that the youth contract is largely clearing up part of the mess that we have, at least in part, created ourselves. Um, and so, you know, I think that needs to be stated first. Having said that, I think it is a good idea. Um, you know, it's a billion pounds um, worth of investment into it. Um, it's um, apprenticeships and it's um, getting people into work. And I think that has to be meaningful work. I mean, I think there's no point in... I was very vocal against the whole workfare uh, thing um, of, of getting people to stack shelves. Well, great, but that's not meaningful work yeah. experience. That is um, slave labour in all but another name. Um, so I think, if you, I think work experience is fine, absolutely great, but it needs to be meaningful work experience that can potentially lead on to actual employment. So, I mean, my answer to your question is, yes, it is a good thing, um, the youth contract, um, but I think the government could be doing more, if I'm honest. Any suggestions to what that more could be? Gosh, well, that's turning it back on me, <laughs> isn't it? Um, well, I mean, my personal view is that the austerity, the austerity agenda hasn't worked um, and that the government should now... Um, have an economic stimulus and should start spending money. I mean, um, one of the things that I advocate, for example, I'm personally aware, and I know there's different views, but I personally advocate folks at 16. I think there's mm -hmm. absolutely no reason why um, young people at 16 who can do so many other things but can't vote. And I mean, the argument against that is that, well, how many of them would? Well, how many in lots of other age groups do? Not very many. That's not a reason to not do it.